It has been a long season for Bellarmine men's basketball. The Knights have just six wins and 26 games, but they hope now a one-time move can provide a spark. Here's WLKY's Kent Taylor. You can go back home again. On Saturday night, Bellarmine will return to its on-campus arena, Knights Hall. I want to see our players feel the energy that they need so badly in fighting through all the adversity and it's gone it's been documented well both personal and physical they 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 deserve that in 2020 the knights moved their home games to 18,000 seat freedom hall it was perfect during covid with social distancing allowing more fans to experience bellman basketball this weekend with the farm machinery show taking over the fairgrounds and with the Atlantic Sun scheduling a Bellarmine home game, the decision was simple, head back on campus. It's about the students. That's what should be first priority in college athletics. Now, the neighborhood this Saturday night, and we know all the, the everybody's got their favorite local places, it'll be great for them. The Knights have experienced plenty of success in Knights Hall. The gym opened in 1960 and saw Bellarmine win four NCAA regional championships from 2011 to 2017. My wife laughs, my first win ever here. You could literally talk across Knights Hall and say, hey, I'll meet you after the game ad, fill in the blank. And now uh, we want it in demand. EKU currently sits at the top of the Atlantic Sun standings. So Davenport wants a packed house and it's a whiteout. We'll be in here at 2 o'clock on Saturday putting two 2,500 uh, T-shirts on every seat. And there's also a pregame sip and swish where you can purchase one of 180 collector bottles of Bellarmine basketball bourbon. It was distilled by 2011 national champion Forrest Smallwood. In Nightsaw, Kent Taylor, WLKY Sports.